I'm going to demonstrate how to adjust the bypass valve on the Seaflow 53 series water pressure pump, or for that matter, any other Seaflow pump that has a bypass valve. To adjust the bypass valve, we remove this rubber grommet right here at the bottom of the pump. And we use a two millimeter Allen key to make the adjustment. If the pump is cycling, we need to open the bypass valve by turning the Allen key counterclockwise. If the pump won't shut off, we need to adjust the bypass valve clockwise. If we open the bypass valve too much, then the pump won't shut off because it will never reach shut off pressure. So that's something that we have to balance the need for no cycling and the desire to have the pump shut off when we turn off the faucet. I have pre-adjusted this pump to cycle, so let's turn on the pump. So here we are cycling. Now I will adjust the bypass valve, turning it counterclockwise. That's one turn, and that cycling has stopped, but let's see where we are by turning the flow down. Really pretty good here, and the pump shuts off if I turn it off. Low flow, no cycling. High flow. Seven gallons per minute. Turning it down. No cycling. This is dialed in pretty good and it turns off. But let's say that we over adjusted the bypass valve by making it too far open. Let's go another turn and see what happens. Turn the pump on and down. No cycling. Now the pump's not shutting off, so we have opened the bypass valve too much. Now the pump shut off. We're back to where we were before, so this should be pretty good. Full flow, coming down, no cycling, and off. This is the perfect adjustment right here. And when we're all done, just put that grommet back on the pump. And we're good to go.